All right, now let me just go ahead and open gallery application. I'll tap on camera folder. I'll open a particular image here. When I swipe this image, the next file is a video file here. And when I take my fingers off of the screen, the video plays automatically. As you can see, we have got a play pause button at the bottom. We have got a volume on or off button. And we also have the slider bar, which will enable us to forward or rewind the video. This is a cool advanced video player we have got within this gallery application. I somehow missed out on including this particular feature in one of my previous videos where I showcased some of the best useful feature available in the gallery application. If you have missed that video, go ahead and check the link in the description. I shared about 10 cool features of Samsung gallery application. So how did I enable this advanced video player? So that's what we are going to take a look at in this video. Before we go ahead, if you are new here, make sure to subscribe to watch some cool contents on Samsung Galaxy phones, Android apps, Galaxy watches and anything related to technology. Do smash that like button if you find this video useful. Now let's get right into it. To enable this advanced video player, all you need to do is just tap on this hamburger menu, go to settings, tap on gallery labs. Now here is the trick. We've got Filmstrip in Weaver. We've got Video Seek on Filmstrip in Weaver. So if these two switches are enabled, you will not have advanced video player option anywhere in the settings. Now what we are going to do is we will disable these two switches, the Filmstrip in Weaver as well as Video Seek on Filmstrip in Weaver toggle. I'm going to disable. Even now we are not going to see this advanced video player option here. So all we need to do is just close the gallery application and again open it. Let's go to settings, again to gallery labs. And now here you can see Filmstrip in Weaver and Video Seek on Filmstrip in Weaver both are disabled. And under Video Weaver, you can see advanced video player option is available here. This is how we can get advanced video player option under gallery labs. Here I'm talking about One UI 3.0 and One UI 3.1. As far as One UI 2.5 is concerned, this particular feature or this particular advanced video player is available right there under Samsung Gallery Labs. But on One UI 3.1 and One UI 3.0, it is a bit complicated. Here you have to make sure you have disabled film strip and video seek options. So that is when we are going to get this advanced video player. Now there are a couple of reasons why I like this particular feature. The first one is it gets rid of the film strip at the bottom. So there is no film strip here. Second reason is it automatically starts playing the video. I don't even need to press the video play button here. It just starts off and I can also keep the volume muted so that it doesn't play with the audio. The third reason is of course it gets rid of the video seek option as well. And not just that, it also supports play, pause and seek in video preview and mirroring on TV. So if you're mirroring a video on the TV, you get one touch access to forward or rewind the video. That is definitely cool. All right, now I have got a question for you guys. How many of you did notice this particular feature? Do let me know about it in the comment section below. Of course, it's very easy to notice this on One UI 2.5 because the moment you open the gallery labs, you will see that switch right on top. But on One UI 3.0 and 3.1, it is a little tricky. Anyways, let me know your thoughts about it in the comment section below. And if you like the video, make sure you smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Thanks a lot for watching, you guys. Take care and stay safe. I will see you in the next one. Cheers, bye-bye.